Hey guys, and welcome to another LEGO set review, where today we're going to be reviewing the LEGO Bowser Jr.'s Clown Car. This is set 71396, has 84 pieces, and one figure. So, um, let's talk about that one figure. Alright, so here's the one figure, which is just, you know, your standard LEGO bob -omb. Um, he's the same build as all the other bob um, from all the other games, or from all the other sets. And same mechanic as the others, you knock him over, and you have to just start spawning. You have to hit him as much as you can before he blows up, and um, I lost. <laughs> Kinda lost track. Um, so yeah, same mechanic as the others. Alright, now let's get on to the main build. Now this is the main build, the actual uh, clown car. Uh, of course, this is Bowser Jr.'s clown car. Um... I believe it first showed up, I want to say Mario Galaxy, but it's actually not. I think it's Mario World, or at least iterations of the clown car showed up in Mario World. Bowser Jr. showed up in Sunshine, so I think... I'm going to say it at first originated, I'm going to say it originated from Sunshine, Mario Sunshine. Um, so yeah, um, on the GameCube. So, yeah, GameCube. So, the cool thing about this is you can actually put Bowser Jr. in here. I don't have my Bowser Jr. figure built yet. But, so basically, as you can tell, this little propeller piece, when you set it down, it actually flattens. So it can actually go in, so that one, it can land, so it can, one, it can sit and stuff. But also so that you can put Mario in there. Just drop Mario. I apologize for that. That is my fault. Sorry, Mario. Put it back in there. Put Mario in there. Just close around. <clears throat> Get you that cool little sound effect. And of course if he falls out, he gets massive dizzy. So um that's pretty cool. Um obviously he's got the gloves for you know like whenever he fights Mario. Or um it's the cool face I guess. Uh so yeah. Um that's pretty much it. The cool thing I will say about this is it's such a simple design that I could almost build it completely without looking at the instructions, but I did kind of have to look at the instructions today. So yeah. Alright, um, see you guys in the next review. Peace.